Okay, you guys, so get into this. So Jason Lee is dropping some real tea. Now he's claiming that Megan Thee Stallion and Winnie Harlow got into a physical altercation at Michael Rubin's all white party. I wish you the best. You seem happy today. Um, everybody keeps asking me to release the tea on Megan that I said I was gonna release. Um, she got in a fight with Winnie Harlow at uh, Michael Rubin's party. I don't have all the d full details yet, and I'm waiting on the video. But I've texted Megan and Winnie, so there you go. Boom. Hold on. Have a good weekend. It's time for thoughts and prayers. Now, even though that's very shocking, people are trying to figure out why these two ladies got into a fight at the party. What was said? Was it that Megan was drinking? Were they both drunk? We're looking for details now. Jason dropped this tea yesterday and neither Megan nor Winnie have commented about this situation. Now Jason Lee is speaking on there being a video. I wonder if he gets a hold of that video, will he release it to the public? And I just find this very odd because I never would have thought Megan the Stallion and Winnie Harlow would get into a physical fight. I mean, I just did not see that coming. But I wanna know what do you think it was that caused these to to get into that fight at the party and who do you think won the fight y'all let me know what you think in the comments moving on to the next story okay you guys so fans are coming down hard on ari after she did the suspect challenge with her family now particularly with yoshan she made a comment about her not wanting to get back with his dad and it sent him into a rage take a look suspect claiming to be in love but always living a single life <laughs> Suspect finally got her and then stopped being a runaway. <laughs> Suspect claim to be a girly girl, but always ashy than a mother. <laughs> Suspect always want to go out, girl, stay inside. Suspect just broke in. He always changes clothes and never flushes the toilet. <laughs> Suspect's on a second engagement in two years. <laughs> My sis, keep him in, honey. Thank you. Suspect claim to be skinny, but stay on that. <laughs> Suspect got a car but can't drive. Suspect claimed to be going through puberty but been the same height since fifth grade. <laughs> That's not true. Suspect always in a bad mood and on the phone with a boyfriend. <laughs> Suspect always want to go out with money but not her beautiful son. What? Oh, what? Ew. Suspect mad I don't want to be with his daddy. Nah. <laughs> Suspect really crying. It was a joke. Like, tighten up, bruh. <laughs> Now, people felt like Ari did not pay attention to your son and what he was saying, especially when he brought up the fact that she spends more time with Moneybag Yo than him, and they felt like she was wrong for bringing up his dad that way. Now, another thing that fans noticed is that your son was swinging on Ari, and they felt like that was very inappropriate, and this is what they had to say. A lot of truth in this joke coming from a child. Just because it's a game doesn't mean it's meant for kids. Um, why is he hitting her? He already be cussing. She got to nip that in the bud now. Some things you just don't post. Suspect swinging on his mom. Yeah, she made a mockery of his feelings. To a kid, mom and dad is all they know in their little world. To a grown-up, it's funny. To a kid, that's trauma. So what do you guys think? Do you guys think that Ari needs to listen to your son when he says, Mom, you're spending more time with money bag yo than me. And do you think Ari is wrong for sitting there and playing with your son about his dad? And again, what do you think about your son swinging on his mom? Now me personally, I could never even think about swinging on my mama growing up. I don't care how mad I got. And my son knew better than to ever try me like that. But how did you guys grow up? Y'all let me know what you think in the comments about all of this, but that's all I have for you. And I'll talk to you later. Okay, y'all, I forgot to record, but that's how I get off the plane. So as soon as I walk off the plane, you know when you're going out and it's that little door right there, I walk out of there and I come down those stairs and then... Did you record? Oh, no, he didn't think about me. And then I come in the car and then they drive me to wherever you want to be drove to, really. But I go to a nearby hotel and then I wait on my, um, my driver to come and pick me up. Well, he's there already. But, yeah, that's pretty much how... This works. And then my luggage. So since I check luggage, they just go right over there and um, get my luggage as soon as it comes off the plane. And then I just put it in there so I don't have to go to like baggage claim or nothing. And that's pretty much how this process works when you get off um, on the back of the plane.
Well, fight, whatever. I don't know. So it's like claiming to be in love, but always living a single life. <laughs> Back to Atlanta, guys. You can stop putting your head like that. You treat me like a stranger, and I feel so wrong. All you do is snap. Hi, Britt. Hi, Mike. A remedy shoe. Hi, Lamek. <laughs> close your eyes. Just close them. There you go. Well, you can look all the way up at the ceiling. Y'all, we get we putting these cheering to work and all that. We ain't fucking around around here, at remedy. Okay, everybody must work. Christmas coming up. Yep, exactly, Zoe. Sit up straight in the chair. Y'all ain't doing y'all job. Y'all supposed to be telling her what to do. So you got this. You doing an amazing job. You look so pretty. Y'all, I'm done eating bad after the day. Look, I'm getting big. But today I got Chiba Hut. Oh, that arm getting big for her. I need to slow down. Don't worry, y'all. My medicine is on the way. I won't, I won't be eating no more. I got Chiba Hut. This is something that's only in Atlanta. I think. Turkey. Can I get a piece? Yep. Um, tomato. Pickle. Red onion. Lettuce. Mm -hmm. Chipotle mayo. Regular mayo. You gotta curl it all. Um, hot peppers. <laughs> You're playing, right? <laughs> yeah. Mm hmm. Yo, I'm so tired of you eating. <laughs> and then, like, just really eating like a fat person. Mm. Y'all want to get a little close up? Oh, it's dripping. Look at the back. Ooh. Let me go and bite that right now. A little spicy. Ooh. 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 I gotta chill. People watch your story one time. Mm. I had to make sure I'm not chill. I said watch. I wanna see. Oh. Mm. Hand me that. 